All right, hi there. My name is Kenya Chestnut. Do I have to introduce myself every video or I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, hi there. My name is Kenya Chestnut. I'm 19 years old. I am now a rising sophomore honors finance major at Howard University. Anyway, though, I've been doing a lot of thinking. Right now, it's May 11th, 2021. School's been over for a week now, and I've kind of just been reevaluating the whole year. But anyway, though, I was reading a book. It's called So Good They Can't Ignore You, another one by Cal Newport. Right now, I'm like five chapters in, and it's just been really making me think. One thing that I've realized though from this year is that I haven't spent a lot of time reading. Obviously books do feature in my videos, but at the start of 2021, my goal was to read a book a week. And I think I've read three or four books this year and we're like four or five months into the year. So obviously I'm not hitting that goal right now. But yeah, I was reading this book and I've just kind of realized I haven't been reading as much this year. And I think a lot of that has been just the fact that I'm on my phone a lot especially like the past month or two. I think I've been on my phone for like close to six hours a day, which is just ridiculous, obviously. But I don't know. I don't wake up and say like, I'm going to spend six hours on my phone today and then go to sleep at like 2 a.m. in the morning. But I feel like it just happens like every day for the past month and a half. And so I don't want that to happen anymore. So here's my goal. I'm going to read a book a week for the rest of this summer. And the reason I'm doing this is because I have a lot of questions right now. Just questions about the world, the future, questions like how to live a meaningful life, how to enjoy the work I do. Like one of my biggest fears is working a job that I don't enjoy, which is actually why I'm reading this book. Because this book is focused on like how to find joy in the work that we do. But yeah, I have a lot of questions and books have always provided answers to some of my questions. Like whenever I want to learn something, I can just read a book. And I feel like in the past couple of months, I've used YouTube videos to learn things. And don't get me wrong, like YouTube is great. There are many great creators like Matt Diavella, Nathaniel Drew, Graham Stephan, Nate O'Brien. There are definitely a lot of creators making great content, videos that will inspire people. And I've definitely been inspired by YouTube, but I think my consumption level has gotten to the point where I'm consuming too much information to the point where it's stopping me from doing the things that I need to do. And so yeah, I think that books are a better way for me to learn, but also not get addicted to my phone. So yeah, I'm reading a book a week and feel free to join me. I think, again, to hold myself accountable, I will update you guys. Maybe I'll use the community page to post what book I'm reading, give a summary of it, post the date that I started reading it, and then the date that I finished it. And I'll also post some reviews on my Instagram story. So feel free to follow me on Instagram. I'll probably show my Instagram somewhere here. But the point is, I wanna read a book a week just to learn. I feel like I've always learned more outside of the classroom. In fact, the reason why I wanted to read a book a week at the start of the year was because I didn't feel like I was learning enough in school. I felt that I could learn more outside of school than actually in the classroom. And in a way, I still did just by starting this channel. But I definitely wanna get back to reading more. Like in high school and even my first semester of college, I would basically go to school, do schoolwork, maybe do some sports after school, do homework, and then at 10 o'clock I would read for an hour. And it was great. Like I've definitely read some very interesting books and I've just learned so much just from that habit of reading for an hour every night. And like every day I would look forward to just that hour of peace where I could just read and engage with ideas. And I wanna get back to that. So yeah, again, I'm gonna read a book a week. Feel free to join me. It would be cool if we could read a book a week together. But also I hope that this video doesn't make you feel guilty for not reading. Cause I feel like in society, it's almost like if you're watching Netflix or you're just relaxing and it's considered not being productive. And I disagree with that. Obviously, it's important to relax. And so if your way of decompressing from school or work is to watch Netflix or go on YouTube, and that's totally fine. Like, I definitely understand that. But again, for me right now, I'm at a point in my life where I have a lot of questions. And I've always felt that reading books have answered questions I have. So yeah, I want to get back to reading consistently. Kind of develop that habit again. But yeah, if there's a habit that you've always wanted to develop, but you've kind of just put it off, whether out of fear 
or just kind of being in that cycle of wanting to do something, but you just can't bring yourself to do it. You feel like you have no discipline. I feel like right now is the time to start. And so I hope that we can all start something together. For me, it's reading a book a week. Maybe you guys can do that too, but if you're not interested in that, I hope that we can all start something and just engage with each other and motivate each other. But yeah, I think this video is kind of getting a little bit longer than I thought it would. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I feel like I haven't been as consistent with making videos in the days that I upload, but my goal is to make a video at least once a week and to upload it every Monday. So yeah, expect a video at least once a week from me on a Monday. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.